Hi guys, Leo from HTP again, and I wanted to go live. Um, I busted out a new part today. Um, we've been talking a lot about the 2017 and newer fuel systems, and looking for options for um, high flow fuel pumps and um, wanting to incorporate the factory tank. So originally we were trying to do an in-tank pump. Uh, we sourced the in-tank pump, um, put together a bunch of brackets, made a bunch of designs. And um, when we started sourcing everything, we found that it was getting to be pretty pricey. So um, instead, we just decided that we're going to do a tank plate, kind of similar to the ones that I have right now for the, um, the boosters and the 14s and the older 1000s. So I made a 2017 tank plate. And it's the same setup and incorporates the ore fittings that has the full 360 degree rotation. Um, that way you can choose whatever external fuel pump you want, you know, which ranges from you know, 150 to thousand dollars depending on what, whatever pump you want. So um, the assembly will come with a nipple, come with a plate. Um, I made it to fit the factory O-ring and um, you would just decide whether or not you need a 6AN or an 8AN um, line, which we also make here too if you need custom lines for that we can do that. So. What I wanted to do was just show you the assembly and then I'm actually gonna put it on the tank and throw it on the bike. That way you can kind of see how much space is underneath the tank for you to work with. And um, you can see it with our um, low profile crank breather cover. And that way you'll have an idea of like what kind of space you can use for your fuel pump. So, um, this one is already obviously set up with the return. It'll come with the nipple. And let me just throw a couple of these. I marked which way it goes. It is not symmetrical. So you have to put it this way. Um, the arrows point towards the tank bracket, the mount. Don't forget the o-ring when you do it. I didn't put the o-ring in, but it's right here, and um, it, you just reuse the back of the one. So, all right. Let me slide this in here. So you can see, we do have, like I said, the low profile um, crank, crank case breather cover on there, but I do feel if you can get in there close and see that there's enough space, hopefully to work with the stock setup. But um, however way you wanna rotate your, your lines, you can. You should have plenty of space in there to put your external pump. So I only made a couple. This tank's going on, this plate's going on this bike. We gotta wrap this one up. And um, I'm gonna go ahead and get stock on order so we can crank out some more in the next week or two. So I should have them available. If you guys have any questions or need any advice for your fuel system, just give us a call. Um, we are doing the aftermarket, um, not aftermarket, we're doing the modified stock fuel injectors. So if you need those done too, make sure you send those in to us for us to modify. But um, this is just a great setup. A factory pump, I think, is good for like 275. So you guys who are over that, Real Street guys or whoever else um, who wants to run that factory tank, um, give us a call. This is a great option. All right, thanks.